What's good, YouTube? How y'all doing, man? Welcome to a brand new video, man. Today, we're going to get into a live sniping session. Now, I ain't did a live sniping session in a minute, so I just decided, hey, let me bust one out for y'all, man. Who knows what the block going to be talking about? If you guys are interested in buying mud coins, go to my sponsor, use code DOG for a 5% discount on checkout. If you guys want to see the series where I make a million coins in a week, if you guys want to see that, man, I'm going to put the first episode in the description. Go watch that video after this video. Drop a like on that video. When that video hit 300 likes, I'll upload episode two i just want to get on a game man and, and i want to snipe a little bit the market is a uh, a little funky it's a little funky right now uh, it's, it's high right now but at the same time cards are not moving so it, it's, it's like in a weird place so people are not really buying cards so you can kind of um you can make a lot of moves if you know what the prices are if you know what makes sense you know what i'm saying i'm gonna say you probably can make like 10 to 30k on some of these cards, man, if you if you got the right prices and you get them for the right prices, you probably, you could probably make a nice little change off of them, man. So I'm gonna go through, I'm gonna see what I could do, see see what the price is talking about. I'll explain to you guys the moves that I'm making, and then you know we're gonna go ahead and make some coins together, man. It's, it's just that simple. But I want to know where you guys at in your Madden experience. Are you guys still playing the game? I mean, what, what's going on, man? Let me know, man. Are y'all still sniping? Matter of fact, this is what we're going to do, man. If you guys are not playing the game, put a zero down in the chat. If you guys are still playing the game, still enjoying the game, go ahead and put a one in the chat. I just want to see. I just want to see what's going on with y'all, man. I want to see what everybody doing, man. Because right now, I ain't really playing the game. I'm still sniping, still making coins, stuff like that. Madden 19, I didn't really play the game much. Madden 18, didn't really play the game much. Madden 17, I did. But then after that, it was just like... Nah, because it seemed like the gameplay just got, like, trash. It really just got terrible, in my opinion. So, I was like, nah, I ain't going to play the game. But, why my shirt look like it's, it's all, like, strung out, bro? Like, I don't know why my shirt look like that, man. I look like a goofy, cuz. Anyways, I'm out here looking goofy. But, yeah, we're going to try to see what to do, man. I'm I'm very interested to see what's happening on the block. I went ahead and did the 96 to 97s because I've been dropping a lot of coin making methods for people who have low coins. So I wanted to, you know, switch it up, switch it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I look at the office alignment, by the way. Sometimes I don't. It just depends on how I'm feeling. I'm going to go through the office alignment one time for the one time and see what the vibe's like. Let's see. We might have we might have a little something already. Let's see. Mm. Mm. Let's see, 175, 17K. That's, I think that'd be like a nice 16K. It's a nice 16K. I'm gonna put them up on 178. It'd be a nice 16K. Not only crazy, but some, you know, some, some, some that might move a little quick. It may move quick. It may not. Who knows? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm. We just, we just rocking with the market. You know what I'm saying? We just trying to make a little profit here and there. We're gonna put them up eight hours because you know, car selling slow. I ain't in no rush to get these coins back, man. I ain't in no rush. I'm, I'm trying to get back to the. Uh, to the how to make a million coins in, in, in a week that's what i'm trying to do i'm trying to get back to that account so so yeah that's interesting man somebody put this up for 350 coins that's crazy y'all see with the training man what should i do with all this training man y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think i should do with this training should i pull some packs should i wait till tomorrow because you know tomorrow they finna drop the ah you could do some of these but you can make these so cheap that actually he's a center so these centers are up there in price I don't want to go too crazy. Let's see. If we the cheapest we can sell them at is 152. Let's just say we sell them at 150. We only make a 70 7k. I don't think invest investing 128k to make 7k is worth it in my opinion. I mean, he might sell fast too, but I don't know. I just ain't gonna rock with that one. I'm gonna leave that alone. I'm gonna let that slide. That's something that we 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 not too much worried about. Let's see what this Brian Bulaga talking about. No P on the Chargers now. Almost went to the Packers. Let's see. See 141. Now, now this is one that I would I you could, you know, do something with it. If you put them up for 160, it's gonna take out 16k. That's gonna put you at like what 145, if I'm not mistaken. I think it is 140 or 144. So that'd be a 10k. That wouldn't be too terrible. That wouldn't be too terrible. Let's see what Mitchell Schwartz is talking about. It wouldn't be too terrible. Like some of these are some moves that you could make. He's a reach. He now he could sell for that 200k, but that's a reach, bro. That's a reach. I'm cool. I'm cool off that. I'm cool off that. I'm cool off that. Like, some of these you could make moves on, but, like, for me, it's like, uh, this man right here, bro, he just, he's not going to sell for what I want to sell him for. Like, if we look at his price, 115, you look at how many at once, and he, bro, you're not doing nothing. Now, if you want him for your team, cool. You know what I'm saying? You, you can get away with that, but 
nah, you can't make no coins off of that. Can't do nothing with that. But um, some of these, you know, I, I feel like it's it's just like if you feel it, if you feel like that car can sell for that price, and it makes sense, you know, take the leap of faith. But if 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 it's just not, if you don't feel it, man, don't do it, man. Cause I always go off of my intuition. If it ain't, if I don't feel like it's gonna sell, but it's a decent price. I just leave it alone, man, because it ain't nothing to find another car to make 10k on. You know what I'm saying? But you, it's it's gonna suck if you get a car and then he don't end up selling. You know that's gonna hurt. You're gonna be like, dang, I'm I'm gonna be sitting on this car for a minute. I don't know, bro. But honestly, going past Kyle Fuller, man, if y'all want a cornerback who got some decent hit power, he got like 79 hit power, which is pretty decent, man. He got pretty solid hit power. Uh, y'all could go pick him up, man. That Kyle Fuller, he would be kind of nasty on your team, man. He he's he ain't gonna be sorry. I promise you that. I promise you that he ain't gonna be sorry. Where am I going? I'm going to Vic. Uh, with Team Young Falcons. Let's see. Let's see what this Vic talking about, man. Let's see. Nada. Can't do nothing with that, man. Can't do nothing with that. It's funny. It's funny, man. Like a lot of people be saying, like they don't know how to snipe, man. It's 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 literally it's simple, bro. It's no, I don't know the prices like that, man. I'm just hopping on just as well as like a lot of people might know the prices better than I do. But what I'm doing is I'm just looking at these cars like some of these prices make sense. Some of these prices don't. You know what I'm saying? It makes sense for uh, Antonio New Gates to be 176. You know what I'm saying? It makes sense. But some of these prices don't make sense. Like that Calais Campbell, like or this, even Jason Peters. This is kind of cheap, man. 117 kind of cheap. But at the same time. He is a team of the year player. You can make these players super cheap. Now, buying him at 117, if I put him up at 140, it's going to take out 14K. That's going to put me at 126. That's only 9K. And that's the problem with some of these cars, man. Some of these... And, and, and 9K, in a perfect world, if we wasn't sniping 96s and 97s, 9K is solid, bro. Like, that's a solid pickup. You could, you could you know, that's a good, that's a good pickup, honestly. But when we snipe in 96s and 97s, it's kind of it's kind of tough for me to take a, it's a 9K, man. Always, my theory is anything over 10. Sometimes you could push the 9s if you know for sure it's going to sell. But anything over 10 with me, man, that's how I look at it. I don't try to get nothing that ain't going to make me at least 10K. Because you invest in so much money in these, uh, so much coins in these cars. And then on top of that... If these cars drop in value, oh, it's over for you. You know what I'm saying? You sitting on the car that's gonna drop 20K in value, you probably gonna have to wait till next week just to get your coins back or make some profit. Um, when you sniping, I will say, you know, sometimes if you do get a car that, you know, it, you gotta take an L on, sometimes you, it is okay for you to say, all right, let me just make 1K profit here. Let me just make 2K profit here. That's cool, that's solid. You know what I'm saying? There ain't nothing wrong with that because it's better to make one to 2K profit than take an L on the car. You feel me? Like, don't ever think that, you got to take an L on something. I know these cheap, but I still want to check. Yeah, they see, they, they all hover in that 130 range. The best thing I could see is probably getting it for like 100K. But let me show y'all something real quick. Look at this car. I just want to show y'all real quick. I know this ain't got nothing to do with the video, but if I was playing, if I was running a, a, a corner, I would definitely run him, man. 81 hit power. That's pretty good, bro. 81 hit power. That's not solid. He's, he's just as good as... Um, they just released a new corner. Whoever the new corner is, he's just as good as him. He'll have the same speed. Uh, Patrick Peterson, I think. But obviously, more hit power and better zone coverage. But anyways, if I was running him, I'd probably, yeah, i mess with Cuz. Because he'll be a solid corner. He'll be a solid corner, man. I like him. 99, 99 zone, like, without cams, he's going to play really well. I haven't even been looking to see if any of these filters full. I just assume that none of these filters are full. They can't be full because it's not that many 96s and 97s. He was going for like 180, was he not? Or was I am, am I am I tweaking? Am I tweaking? Let's see. Let's talk. Let's talk. 141, 167, 171, 170. So let's just say we put him up for 170. I feel like he could sell that 170, right? 17k put me at what? 143 or 153? 153, right? So that's 11k on a card that should sell pretty fast. <sighs> I I I may do it. I think it I think it might be a good move. It's only gonna be one card in front of me. Let me just do the math real quick. Let me make sure. So, cause I don't wanna be I don't wanna be looking stupid. Uh, yeah, one fifty three. That's twelve k on the card. You know what I'm saying? I 
I can make that work. I can make that work. So we're going to put him up for 170 and we're going to make some check. Hopefully he sell pretty fast. I don't expect these cars to sell ASAP. You know what I'm saying? Because I know that ultimate, I mean, golden tickets is coming out tomorrow, all that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? It's probably one of the worst times I could snipe, but I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident in my prices, the, the price that I'm putting these cars up for. I'm pretty confident because look at this. Watch this. There's only one card in front of him. Like I'm not, I'm not tripping off of that. Like they put this card up two hours ago, didn't sell, right? There was a car earlier, I think, up for like 157 that we passed up, and he sold. And then this 167 has only been up for roughly probably about an hour because it's only 30 minutes. So he could sell within an hour, two, doesn't matter, man. As long as he sells within you know a decent amount of time. So that's a solid 12k. I can't, I can't be mad at that. I can't be mad at that. Solid price. Second, he's the second one on the auction, the second cheapest one on the auction block. It's fine by me, you know what I'm saying? That's a good price. But let me go to this Michael Vick real quick and let me show y'all something. This is this is this is where I say up here you become a top tier sniper when you do this a lot when you do this a lot, right? So just peep. I just want y'all to peep. I want y'all to peep what the prices people have been putting Michael Vick up for, right? So I put Michael Vick up for 170, right? Peep the prices of the newest cars, right? So let's look at the newest cars. So I put them up for 170. These two people right here are just trying to sell them quick, right? These two people are selling them for the price that he's at. My price is 9K lower than his price that he's at. Even me not even knowing his price. Me just looking at the market like, yo, these are the, like, I'm looking at the market like, yo, okay, I could put him up for this price, right? I could put him up for like 170 and still, still make decent profit. So let's just say, hypothetically speaking, somebody does go to Mutthead. If they go to my head and they buy and the 154 buys and the 156 buys and the 167 buys and the 170 is up, his price is going to go down a little bit. Let's just say his price is at 179. Let's just make it even 180. After these two cars buy, let's just say these three cars buy, his price is going to dip maybe to about 172 maybe. Mine's is up for 170. I'm still below his price. Let's just say he dipped down to 160. It's up for 170. It's only 10K above price. You know what I'm saying? So... Sometimes that's why I want to use my head, because if you know what you're looking at and you know what you're doing, you really don't need it for the most part. I'm not going to say that you don't always need it because there's a couple cars that you're like, yo, I ain't never seen this. How much he going for? And sometimes they be going for a bag and you don't even know. But sometimes you can see a car that's going for a bag and he really only going for like 100K. So it's, it's hit or miss, man. Sometimes it sometimes it's just like that. If y'all want to see the series of how we making a million coins in a week make sure y'all drop a like man go ahead on that last video i'm gonna put it down in the description box go ahead click on that thing watch it all the way through drop a like on the video i just want to say that i appreciate each and every one of y'all for subscribing to the channel yeah I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep dropping bangers for y'all man it don't matter what's going on it don't matter what's going on with the market it don't matter what's going on with nothing i'm gonna keep dropping bangers for y'all you see we got these two cars obviously cam what got so we got these two cars man we made well like 10k 20 20k in 20 minutes not nothing crazy i mean if you still want to average it out that's 60k an hour not not nothing crazy but we're sniping at the highest of the high you know what i'm saying 96 to 97 it's a high filter i don't expect that filter to convert too often when there's no promos so hey it is what it is man if you guys enjoyed this video drop a like subscribe to the channel and i'm gonna see y'all in the next video